welcome back to another makeup tutorial this is a beginner eye makeup look and this is the finished look so if you want to see how i get this please keep on watching first i'm going to go ahead and start off with my concealer and this is from mac in nw45 you could go ahead and use a primer but i prefer a concealer so what you want to do is conceal your whole entire eyelid and this will hide any dark spot in this coloration and i'm also taking that and i'm going to clean up underneath my brow bone Next, I'm going to take my damp beauty blender and I'm going to go ahead and tap it right onto the eyelid. And the reason why I'm doing that just so that it could be blended out and the color on the eyelid could be more smoother. Next, I'm going into my Sasha Buttercup setting powder and I'm going to go ahead and set the eyelid because I do have a lot of creases. So I'm going to go ahead and set it. Next, I'm going to go into my Patrick Star eyeshadow palette and I'm going to take three brushes. The first one is a more bigger and fluffier and this is for the first shade. The second one is more smaller and also more fluffier. And the third one is flat and more softer and this is for the eyelid. Now I'm going to go into a transition shade and you want to start off with a kind of very soft transition shade and I'm taking that first one I'm tapping it off and then I'm gonna start with the outer corner first and then I'm gonna go into a circular motion as you can see right here and then I'm gonna blend it right into the inner corner and the reason why I start with the outer corner first is because you want more of the color to be on the outer and less of the color to be on the inner and you want to take a little bit of color and then go ahead and build it up and I'm putting it right into the inner crease and a little bit above the crease so just go ahead and take your time and build it up Now you want to make sure that you do not blend it all the way up into under your brow bone. Do not do that. Keep it a little bit lower and just continue to blend and blend and blend. Now this is the second brush and I'm going into the second color which is more darker than the first one. And I'm going to go ahead and tap it on right onto the outer corner first. And I'm not going to bring it all the way in. I'm going to keep it right at the outer corner and blend it in to the center. And I'm going to keep it right there and just blend it out. And you want to go ahead and build it up and put more color just so that you could get the desired color payoff that you want and i'm going to go ahead and put some right onto the eyelid a little bit onto the outer eyelid for the third color
So I'm going to go back into the first shade and the first brush and I'm going to go ahead and blend both colors together. But you don't want to blend too much. You only want to blend the line, the harsh line and just make everything marry together. Next, I'm going to go into my third brush, which is a flat brush, and I'm going to spray my brush with some Fix Plus Spray. And then I'm going to take the third shade, which is for the eyelid. And this is a very gold champagne shimmery shade. And the reason why I spray my brush is because I want that color to be more brighter. Now I'm going to go ahead and put it right into the crease. And I'm following my shape of my crease and I'm gonna tap it on first just so that the line can be more even and just go ahead and just tap and follow my crease as you can see how I am doing it and make sure you take your time so as you can see I am right into my crease this is where I want the line to stop and I'm gonna go ahead and tap it and I'm not gonna bring it all the way down. I'm stopping where I started the second shade. After that, you're gonna go ahead and put the rest of the color onto the eyelid. You can also go ahead and use your fingers. If you don't prefer a brush, take it and put it right onto the eyelid and this also would give it a nice, more brighter, vivid color. Then you're gonna go ahead and make sure that line is more even because you do not want your line to be crooked. Next, I'm gonna go into the second color and I'm gonna go ahead and tap it on right onto the outer corner so that both colors on the eyelid and the other corner could blend because you definitely do not want any uneven color right there. So make sure that you blend both of them together. Next, I'm gonna go into my Bad Girl Bang Mascara and I'm gonna go ahead and coat my lashes. Next, I'm gonna take these false lashes and I'm gonna go ahead and put it on. If you want me to do a very detailed, in-depth lash tutorial for beginners, leave it in the comment section below. But for now, I'm just gonna go ahead and put these lashes on. So this is the finished eye. I'm gonna go ahead and finish off the rest of my face off camera, but pretty much this is the finished look. Okay guys, so this is the finished look. I will be having a detailed makeup tutorial on this whole entire look on my Tuesday video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you again in my next video. Bye guys.